Hello everyone. In this screencast, I am going to show you how to do area measurements using ImageJ. There are three important steps that are involved for measurement of area in an ImageJ. Step 1 involves setting the scale for which you need an image which has a known distance marked already on it. Be it a CBCT image or you are taking an image of a specimen, you should have a scale set along with it in the same magnification at the same distance. Second point would be to mark the region of interest, the area of which you need to measure. And thirdly, measure them and get the measurements out. So let's quickly jump over to the folder. After you download image, you can see the application icon. Double click on it and you will see a toolbar that comes up. This is the image which I would like to measure. I drag it and drop it on the toolbar and it opens the image. So as you can see here, there are two dots which represent a distance of 2 mm. I use the linear measurement tool here, straight toolbar here and left click on the first dot and end it on the second dot and go to analyze, set scale. And you can see that the distance between these two points is 70.83 pixels and the known distance is 2 millimeters which I write down and say OK. Now the safe scale is set. Now let's use the zoom tool. When you left click, you click on the zoom tool and then left click on the image. It zooms in the area of interest. Use your polygonal selection tool and start marking points on the area of interest. So this radio lucent area is my void which I need to measure. I mark points all around it and you can see that there is a yellow thread like structure that follows your cursor. When you end at the same beginning spot it completes the loop and you are free to adjust the points that you have marked. So the more the points you mark the better it will be. Once you are satisfied with your delineation, go to analyze and measure and you will get the area of the image as 0.214 which you can quickly transfer to an excel sheet 0.214 and you can keep doing the measurements for the remaining sets and give it for statistical evaluation. So these were the steps for area measurement. Thank you.